is explaining more about its recent statement on premarital sex and same sex unions. And tonight, students are also weighing in on the discussion. WIF of News Source Myra Ruiz is live and local tonight in Duet with more. Myra? If you ask people around campus, they say it's the timing of the statement that raised more eyebrows than the statement itself. On February 20th, Erskine College issued a statement that said the school deems sex outside of marriage and between same sexes to be sinful. But it is not meant to be a censure or stricture on any group of individuals. Um, we, we hope that any, uh, in, any student coming to Erskine will feel welcome and appreciated and valued. The statement ended by saying members of the Erskine community are expected to follow the teachings of scripture concerning matters of human sexuality and institutional decisions will be made in light of this position. Um, and in light of this statement, I think it was misconstrued um, to imply that they will start discriminating against uh, the gay community here. Students and staff say they believe Erskine's intentions were misrepresented by media outlets across the country who interviewed two members of the college volleyball team who had identified themselves as gay last year on a national sports website. And we, although we don't have any policies stating that anyone needs to declare anything about their identity, uh, neither do we have any policy that would prohibit someone from from identifying with any particular group. Students say they don't expect anything to change at Erskine following the statement. Even as a gay student myself, I'm not offended at all. And I don't feel unsafe. I don't feel discriminated against. No matter if you're straight or homosexual, I feel like the main goal here at Erskine is to get you closer to Christ. And Erskine spokesman says despite all the attention on that statement, the school actually remains focused on educating the students. Myra Ruiz, WYFF News 4, live in Due West.